and while the universe does continue to expand, fans refuse cannot let go of the character at the center of the tale. James Ghost St. Patrick, portrayed by Amari Hallwork in power, the finality of his death in, this, in the final season of the series at the hands of his son, Therese St. Patrick, is one of the viewers continue to question. Oh, shit, we live. Well, guys, I mean, yeah, well, you know, you, you heard it from me. So, uh, yeah, um, Ghost is dead. So, um, peace. <laughs> Imagine this shit. <laughs> okay, okay. So, I mean, I, I'm going to leave the uh, the article in the description down below. Oh, what do you guys think about this whole, uh, yeah, of a potential spinoff within the spinoff of, you know, ghosts potentially returning back and stuff, right? Because, I mean, hey. Nobody ain't gonna write no doggone article and then explain about, you know, a potential spinoff and stuff about, hey, you know, Ghost is gonna return and stuff because as the fans and as the people been asking for years, like, yo, what's going on? Why, you know, they didn't want things to end with Ghost. They wanted it to continue, not with Tariq, but it is what it is right now and stuff, right? So, there's a lot of possibilities. There's a lot of things that can actually happen. Cause the one thing that I was it was running through my mind about all this when I when the article came out about like, you know, um, you know, potentially of ghosts returning and and the the whole power universe being expanding overseas and stuff. So I was thinking like, remember back in I think it was either season two, I think episode ten, where it was like Ghost is dead. Technically, it was kind of like a foreshadowing of what could actually happen to a ghost in the future, which technically it did when he actually died and stuff, right? I had this idea when, like, the episode, like, the title of, like, Ghost is Dead, and when Amari, well, I was gonna say not Amari, uh, when Ghost himself, James St. Patrick, was like, okay, he didn't want to be called Ghost anymore, he just wanted to be called James, not Ghost anymore, so I was thinking that if this does happen right like if this show does happen and you know uh james st patrick does return wouldn't it technically mean that obviously he would have to be under a different alias because he can't use james st patrick anymore it would have to be under a different name and stuff and no more james st patrick and no more ghosts so it would mean that james st patrick and ghost is essentially dead so it would be a different name than ghost i guess phantom or something but if 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 there was ever to be like a new name for him if they was to bring him back and he's over in the uk because when you think about it the idea doesn't really it, it all well it does make sense though when you think about it the idea of him being in overseas would make sense because you're not gonna have him return and you know just pop up from the dead because then there's gonna be a lot of questions you're gonna have to explain what happened and there is no witness protection there's no nothing so you would have to explain what happened and uh i believe you do go to jail or it's against the law to even fake your own death so it's like he can't you know you can't do any of that so i think potentially it would make sense if they do decide to pick up on the idea of having him you know go over there to the, like the uk or something or overseas or wherever and he has to start over from scratch and stuff now if ramona is with him or not is you know up to us and stuff because well up to them it's really up to them or what they want to do about this and stuff because um you know it's it's potential monies and stuff and they would have to bring like if they're gonna bring back like uh the james st patrick like the character and stuff then the actor who plays as him, like Amari Hardwick, they're going to have to pay this man. Because when he said in the interview where he wasn't getting paid as much and he had to borrow money for 50 cent. And I think, what, what was his money? I think he was even getting paid, I think, 150k per episode or something. But I know he said, like, like he was in a lot of debt. And I know um, he had to borrow money for 50 cent and he wasn't getting as paid as much. So it's like, you're going to have to pay this man. Like, it, you know, and that's, like, one of the things that kind of, like, pissed me off when you have, like, a really good actor or actress and you have, a, like, a really good show, but somebody's being stingy on the money. Like, I understand you got to pay everyone else, like, your, your actors, your actresses, 
uh, the writers, the, the producers, the filmmakers, the camera. Like, honestly, I pay all of them. But it's like when you're the lead of a, of a hit show, I mean, the lead has to get fed. Like, you can't be stingy. Like, I don't know what was going on or something. But, um, you know, they're going to have to do something because if – Power Book 2 goes like once when that officially wraps up again, we don't know if he's going to appear as a, a ghost. We don't know. And same with uh, Power Book 4 Force. We don't know about that either because we don't know if he's going to appear as a ghost because we know Tommy's going to probably there's going to be more mentions of him throughout the two shows. There's going to be more mentions about him, but we don't officially know what's going to actually happen and stuff. Right. But if this potential spinoff does come true then i mean it's gonna make the fans happy and stuff because yeah like they love doing this they love playing with that idea like uh oh uh oh he coming back he coming back and then you know the fans you like hold up what you mean he's coming back and then everybody gets happy and excited because they're like yo he's coming back but then if if it comes out to be true that well there is no there's no nothing it was just talks then you know people are gonna be like all right we can just watch power book two ghosts full force and then raising Canaan, but you know, people like it, but it's not what they really want and stuff. Because everybody love uh, James St. Patrick Ghost. Like they love like the mystique, the lore of the character and stuff. They just love that. But you know, we will have to wait and see. Another idea I was thinking about, like maybe like what if his brother is actually overseas or whatever, and he sees his brother that way. Or as I said before, um, he would have to start over from fresh again. So it's like. He has to, I guess, hustle and grind back into the streets and then for him to build something to be successful. It may not be a nightclub this time. It could be like something else. It could be something entirely different. If he does go over to overseas or whatever and he has to build up from scratch, like I said, and to do something different. But again, we don't know what could, what this spinoff is going to be. It could be... It could be about his brother. Shit, it, it doesn't have to technically have to be about, well, uh, but then again, that, that would still piss people off if, if it's like, okay, this potential uh, spinoff is just about his brother, but not about the character. So, and it's already been set in stone, y'all. Ghost is dead. So, but to resurrect the character and, and say, like, he's able to come back, I mean, you know. Stuff can happen. I mean, it's TV. It's fiction. It's 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 fiction. They could do something. They could they could be like, hey, the character comes back. Like I understand the fans been pissed and they've been anxious to see this man's return. But I mean, if like I said before, if we don't get the spinoff, then there's Power Book Two Ghost. There's the other spinoff shows that people can watch and stuff and just put the character to bed. You if you want to rewatch the character, you can watch like the original Power. I mean, for some people, I, I say this, <laughs> if, it, if it bothers you that much, just watch up to like a certain point <laughs> in the original power and then be like, okay, I can't watch anymore. I'm just going to watch to like that certain point and then just rewatch the shit all over again. Because I mean, hey, there's, there's some people out there who's like, nah, fuck this. He, we need to see our ghost. We need to see James St. Patrick. This is some bullshit. <laughs> but, um. You know, let me know what you guys think about all this. Like, about the spinoff, about him potentially coming back. Uh, but them basically could be like, well, he got shot one time. He was saved at the last minute. But as it said, he's dead. So what can you possibly do to make this man return and make everybody happy? And then if you do make the man return, he has to have like a good ending. He has to have like a really, really good ending. And then people could be satisfied with that rather than, okay, he's dead and then that's it. Because, you know, it doesn't, it still doesn't sit well with a lot of people. So, I mean, I'm just saying, but um, uh, comment down below, uh, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I will catch you all in the next one.